I'm trying to think like what well, what should we use in today's video? We could use the Volk. We could use I'm trying to think. Use the Volk, the MP40. We use a combat shotgun. <laughs> Man, it's kind of a ghost town in here. This is uh this is different. Okay, well, what is going on YouTube? Foxy Goodbye, coming to you guys here with a brand new video, and in today's video, we are going to be revisiting Call of Duty World War II. A lot of people have been asking me for a World War II video again, so I guess I'll give that to you guys since everyone's asking for it. If you guys do enjoy, make sure you guys leave a like down below, subscribe, turn on notifications, and let me know down in the comments what you guys want the game of the month to be, and what other Call of Duty games you guys want me to play. And big shout out to today's video sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. We'll get into that in a couple minutes, but without further ado... Let's go, bros. I'm playing free for all, and I just entered the game, so good god. This is what's it called? This is sandbox, and this map sucks. I can't stand this map actually. This map is garbage. <laughs> I think this was like a really creative map to do, but I don't think it works. It's too, it's too much in in one map, in my opinion. And I know that everyone's like, oh, you know, the three lane maps are terrible, and I I know I've said that as well. But this this map is just too too much. Oh, there we go. Nice headshot. I love the headshot sound in this game. Double kill. There's another one. We're on bloodthirsty. There we go. There's another one. Oh my god. Oh, that's right. I don't have to reload now because I have specialist or whatever. Damn it, dude. Come on. No! No, dude! Fuck! Lots of noobs in this game right now. A lot of people were telling me when I was playing in the last game that I didn't need to reload because I was using Commando and Specialist. And honestly, I completely forgot that that was a perk of Commando. Uh, so, yeah. Sorry. Sponsor time! I want to give a huge shout out to the sponsor for today's video, Raid Shadow Legends. Raid Shadow Legends is an awesome, realistic fantasy RPG with hundreds of champions from 16 playable factions. There's more than 300 unique champions and over 1 million ways to build your champion. And if you install Raid right now on your iOS or Android device with the link provided in the description, you will start with 50,000 silver and get a free epic champion on day 7 of the new player rewards program once again link is in the description and it's free okay so as you guys can see we have everything pulled up here on the screen this is just like the main area of where you can go and do battles and things like that okay so it's two on two i'm not really sure how long this is gonna last probably won't last very long yep there it goes this should be another good one yep knocked him out okay not bad not bad not bad oh we actually might be able to win this let's go that, that should be it yeah let's go man honestly last night I was playing this game for multiple hours, just kind of hanging out after I finished editing a video. It got addicting, you know, the more that you play, the more addicted that you get, so big thank you to Raid Shadow Legends for sponsoring today's video, and the link to download this game will be down in the description below. Back to our scheduled programming. Alright, we got the Volkstam Gamer, and we're playing on USS Alexis, Texas. Good God, I'm terrible. Come on! I probably should be running dead silence, but I'm not. There we go, there's a kill. Let's see if there's anyone. Nope, he's not up here. He might be downstairs. Hey, what's up? Nope. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. No, come on. Come on, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. You gotta be kidding me. People are really using noob tubes in this game! I'm sick of this. <laughs> Call of Duty World War II is like one of those games where you either like it or you hate it. Now, I've kind of grown to be a little fond of this game. I remember when it first came out, I was like, oh yeah, this is cool and stuff. After I saw the microtransactions come in, I was like, oh, this game sucks. I can't stand this game because they would put variants in the drops and things like that. And I didn't think that was fair, even though there were certain variants that you could get in the Quartermaster and things like that, kind of similar to Modern Warfare Remastered. But I just felt like the variants should not have been the, in the drops. Like, if they were going to have a Quartermaster for epic variants, they should have had a Quartermaster for heroic variants as well. And I thought that was fair, but they never did that, you know? And then, in my opinion, they kind of turned the game around when they started adding variants to daily challenges 
challenges and and daily orders not so much the challenges but more so the daily orders because the daily orders didn't cost you anything whereas the daily challenges overpriced your depot credits or overpriced your um your salvage in order to get the new weapons or whatever for example they charge people 7,000 salvage to get the iron curtain 2 which is a heroic variant obviously but still man like that's still like overpriced man there was one day on two specific weekends where you could get it and you know i get that but at the same time i also just love the daily orders and the daily orders had specific weapons that you could get these for or like that you could get these variants for There's, that's a guy right there fucking noob tubes dude all righty we're on point to heck and uh hey there buddy there's a guy we're using the M1941, and this gun is pretty freaking insane. It's got a really fast fire rate. I'm trying to think of like a gun it reminds me of from previous Call of Duties. You could say that this was the F2000 of this game, but it's not as fast as the F2000, of course. But speaking of like really, really fast assault rifles, that's how I would consider this. I thought this map was pretty good when it first came out, but I'm not really a big fan of it now. It's just too circular, and it's just, it's small. I mean, like, I don't mind small maps, and I don't mind circular maps. But it's just bland in my opinion. It's not it's not great by any means. It just doesn't really do anything for me. <laughs> Noob two have an ass, bro. Let's see, we're gonna run out here. Oh, was there a guy in there? Right up here. Goodbye. Got three shots left. Goodbye. <laughs> There's a guy up here. Goodbye. <laughs> Oh god. Wow. I forgot how, how overpowered this gun is. <laughs> I really did. Like, I forgot how overpowered it is. Oh. <laughs> Dude, this gun is just so easy to use, man. Really? Noob tube, stop it! Get out of here. Out of here with that noob tube shit, bro. Goodbye. Let's go. We're just going off now. Not as many bouncing Bettys as I thought there would be. I mean, there's a few, but there's not just a ton. That's a big oof. <laughs> Oh my goodness. We're gonna get we're gonna end up getting flat guns, but <laughs> that's a GG! Oh man. Alrighty. Nice two piece. Three. Stop shooting noob tubes, bro. Alright, so shipments in this game. And it's a lot different than what you would expect shipment to be. In my opinion, it's the better version of shipment out of this version and modern warfare from this past year's call of duty it's just different it flows better the spawns are better at least for um at least for like domination and things like that i wouldn't really say the tdm and all that stuff is or i wouldn't really wouldn't say that free for all has better spawns because it doesn't really have better spawns in my opinion it just depends God, i should have hit that shot man kobe Got a UAV. Come on, man. So I went to my first Caps game last night and it was super fun. Ovi got the hat trick and I was dumb lit about it, actually. That's, that was crazy. That was a great game, man. It's so crazy how when this game was out, I said, shipment's way too chaotic. And now it's even more chaotic in Modern Warfare. 
because of how bad the spawns are. I thought shipment was terrible for this game because of requisitions and all that stuff. Everyone knows how I feel about requisitions. I don't gotta say it a million times. But it's so crazy how much different I feel now because Modern Warfare messed up the spawns so bad. Or I don't know if they, I mean, I guess messed up or intentionally made the spawns like incredibly awful or whatever. It's just crazy to me. Guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys did, make sure you guys leave a like down below, subscribe, turn on notifications. Big shout out to Raid Shadow Legends once again for sponsoring today's video. Make sure you guys go download that. It'll be down in the description and in the pinned comment. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.